Hi everybody, hi ladies and gentlemen. I'm Aldo Bruski, VP at CRIF, a global credit management solutions company. My hat goes off to Finnovate and all presenters for sharing so many interesting things these days. The digital world we live in has raised the bar for lenders. Real-time mobile applications are today a must-have. But not only these are the challenges for lenders. Achieving the growth while keeping under control the cost of credit, the cost of risk. At the same time, to cope with a massive continuous wave of regulatory changes with agility and with ease is what can help the lenders to set the bar higher. The innovation we'll, we'll show you today will help you to do that. And it consists of uh, a secure mobile technology fully integrated with the end-to-end -end processes business credit processes, lending processes, a KPI dashboard to monitor and track with an actionable user-friendly technology to control your decision behind the scene. So, to start the, innovation, the presentation, let me let put myself in the shoes of a customer. I'm a banker instead. I'm a chief commercial officer at Acme Bank. And let me introduce you my Celia advisor, Sheila Donahue. Sheila is on the road. Hi, Sheila. What are you up to? Hi, Aldo. I'm with the customer, and we're looking into financing options for him using this new lending mobile app from CRIF. You'd like the app because it's as secure as they come. And I like it because it integrates with all the key systems that I use back in the branch office, like product catalog, CRM, credit, and pricing. So I'm super productive, and I can produce proposals on the fly as I'm meeting with customers. It has intelligence built in, such as calculating the customer's ability to pay and suggesting monthly long payment amounts they can afford. I hear the app integrates behind the scenes with Chris's Decision Solution Strategy 1, which does the automatic decision making throughout Acme Bank's lending processes. In fact, here you see that Strategy 1 has suggested some alter alternative offers, such as to upsell when the customer's risk profile warrants that they can afford a higher payment. The app is a component of CRIF's process management solution, Credit Flow, which means that it has loan processing functionality built in, such as the creation of electronic documents, such as this proposal we see now. The customer's experience is enhanced and expedited with an e-signature functionality. Once signed, the application is automatically sent to the downstream loan origination process for completion and booking. What do you think, Aldo? You're perfectly right, Sheila. And I'm using the KPI dashboard to monitor my business goals. Wow, but I'm in some problem here. My booking rates, the green line is going down, and the time to yes is way off. No wonder the customer must be unhappy waiting for us and get their loans somewhere else. Meanwhile, the manual referrals are too many. We should have less of those, especially since the bad, rain, the bad rate is in a good shape. I have to call the credit risk department, ask them to look into this. Hello, Gabriele. Hi, Aldo. I'm a Finnovate, enjoying the show. What's up? Good for you, guy. <laughs> look, we have some issues with the credit strategies. We need to find tune. We need to speed up uh, the decisions and to have a better booking rates. Can you have a look at that? We have to be more competitive. Sure, i do it right Thanks. now. Well, I'm not worried because with strategy one, CRIF decision management solution, I can design and fine tune the strategies <coughs> running behind any lending process. What you see here is a typical example of a decision strategy that business users like me and everybody in this room can configure. It consists of calculations, rules, segmentation trees, scorecards, and cutoff that brings to risk level and client offer decision. By opening the simulation capabilities, running all the requests from last quarter production, I can observe the distribution of the credit application among the strategy paths, like you see here. And also, I can double check if the strategy is in line with the expectation by opening the KPI section. 
Oh my goodness, Aldo was right. Automatic approvals are too low, and referrals instead are too high. I need to change something. Now, going back to the strategy, let's drill down into this scorecard cutoff. Hmm, interesting. Since many of these yellow referrals will be approved manually by our credit analyst, I think we can relax this table a little bit and approve these triple B customers like this. Now, going back to the strategy, I can refresh the simulation to see how dynamically uh, the changes affect the results. And as you can see, the distribution has changed. And going back to KPIs, I can see that now the strategy is in line with the expectations. I need to call back Aldo. Aldo, Hi, problem solved on the fly, the strategy has been deployed and it's ready into your iPad in three, two, one, it's here. Thanks. Let's, go to this, uh, let's uh, have a look at the simulation. The referral are decreasing. This is, means that we should have a, a faster response time to our customers and a, back, a better booking rates. Well done, Gabriele. Thank you very much. Well done. So, the simulation is finished. The KPI starts to improve. And the problem is solved by business users having information, intelligence, and tools at their fingertips even while they go. The innovation that we have seen, there are applications configured with the Creve Credit Framework new release, which con consists of a lending technology components used by hundreds of financial institutions worldwide. We offer an approach, a distinctive approach, in which instead of hard coding, you can create and control with an easy accessible technology. So wh whether you are a financial institution looking to speed up uh, your process and to make better decisions in a moment, or you are a solution provider seeking for <coughs> an answer you're offering with our components, we would love to talk with you. We are waiting for you at the Griff booth. Thank you very much. Thank you.